Yo, what is going on YouTube? Listen, my name is Sadboy Fari, and look, in today's video, I'm basically gonna show y'all how Bruce Drop Em Off made Bank Teller, and also just show off a couple of different Wave plugins to show the difference between that and stock. So let's get into it. So look, hopping into FL, as you can see right here, I have three things. I have his song, the instrumental, and me doing the song that he made. So let's listen to how he made it. As you can see, look at the same Wave file. That, that wave file is smacking. All right, so I turned it down just so it don't destroy our ears, but this is how his version of Bank Teller sounds. Now, as you can see, like, since the waveform is that big, like, bro, I ain't gonna hold you, like, the beat is engulfing his vocals. Like, I think somebody in his comments even said, like, no mixing no nothing just straight ass like bro it's like the mixing on this is pretty terrible but i think it's pretty cool just because i was literally just was testing out some different plugins and so i just made a preset and i think that it sounded pretty cool so you know just having fun with it but this is how my version of the vocal sounded the bank telling no the bank telling no now keep in mind, I didn't mix it, but you know, I mixed the beat and the vocals, but still, bruh, like Bruce had potential. If he would've just DM'd me, he could've got a good bank teller. The bank teller no. And now look, let me, let me get into it. No. Just listen to how clean these vocals is though. The bank teller no. The bank teller no, I stay. I'm about to get into the verse of the. Just know niggas keep it glut. Since 19, shit on stock. Running that shit to the, I'm running that shit to the top. <laughs> now I'm about to turn on his. Got a red key, I can't stop, and I'm running that shit to the top. I'm stacking that shit like a mountain. Shit, your money so smart like you stop. I feel like fellow Minotti. Shit, I swear to God, niggas be bots. Now, Bruce's voice is hella deep, and he like was sounding mad emotionless on this song. And I know you know I come in. I'm running that shit to the. Running this shit to the top, but like, look, bro, look, bro, he might not have sounded like that, but that's how I sound, all right. This is my interpretation, and essentially, though, these vocals sound really good because I have been practicing with these different um wave plugins. Essentially, I've been enjoying using Arvox, um, but this time I also used CLA 76, and I believe that this is a I believe that this is Wave's version of some com of a CLA um, compression thing that I think they used to use as like analog gear. If you don't know, analog gear is like physical gear that they have in like the studios. So since we're using plugins, those plugins are basically emulators. Think about it like that. The plugins emulate the actual hardware, but with this plugin right here, I believe that the CLA is an emulated plugin um, based off of a real life CLA. But listen to how the vocals would sound without me having this plugin on here. Just know niggas keep it glut. Since 19, shit on stop. Now I'm about to turn it back on. Running that shit to the running that shit to the top. You feel me? <laughs> like look at how much presence it helps to give the vocals. I'm gonna turn off that and our box. This is how it would sound with just straight stock. Uh, let me turn off fresh air too, I guess. Just know niggas keep it glut. Since 19, shit on stock. Running that shit to the I'm running that shit to the top. Now I'm about to turn it back on. Glut. Just know niggas keep it glut. Since 19, shit on stock. Running that shit to the. I'm running that shit to the top. <laughs> and now look, the reason why I also wanted to make this video is because, as y'all can see, I intertwined the two. I feel like a lot of people choose, like, you're using stock pre plugins at all. Like, you. It's waves all day. It does not matter, bro. It doesn't matter. What matters is the end result that you get. So if you get that by just using mainly waves or mainly stock, listen, bro, it doesn't matter, okay? However you get your results is how you get your results, all right? But that's basically all I wanted to display in this video. Uh, shout out, Bruce, I guess. Uh, if y'all are interested in learning about different wave plugins or just any plugin at all, let me know which one's down in the comments below. And with that being said, man, thank y'all for stopping by. Make sure y'all drop a like on this video. And make sure you subscribe to the channel. You're on the road to 5K. Of course, four before we get to the five. But we on the way to that 5K, man. And if y'all want to join in on the road there, I greatly appreciate it. With that being said, I'll see y'all. Peace. Desire.